All right, what's up, people? Check this out. So, uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken has now offered uh, Beyond Chicken. Boneless chicken, I guess. And I, this is the first time me and my wife are going to try this because my wife is vegan. So, uh, we're going to try the Kentucky Fried Beyond Fried Chicken. And uh, it comes in a green box that they give you the impression that, oh, we're being green. We're trying to save the planet. No, you're selling chicken, bro. That's what you're doing. All right, so this is what it looks like in the box. Alright, you're getting this as we're doing it. So uh I guess it came with fries. You got fries in there. How do you want do some dipping sauce? We got some barbecue sauce. You gonna bust open a good barbecue sauce? Uh we're gonna try this. this little square chickens. I'm I'm gonna just taste one for just the flavor without the barbecue uh on it. So we'll see. Uh, it's supposed to be Kentucky fried chicken. We're gonna see. Alright, so my first impression, what are you going to say, honey? It's nothing special. I tried it. No, wait a minute. My first impression, the texture is there. It is the texture of, say, McDonald's chicken nuggets. I mean, you can tell it's not white meat, but it's pretty good. Look at the inside of it. It is pretty good. It's got the flavor. It's got the texture. Let me try it with some barbecue sauce. Spices in the fried breading. Yeah, it's good. These aren't really vegan, though. No, but it ain't meat. No. no, I mean, well, these are, but I think they're vegetarian. Well, it tastes like um, like a McDonald's. Reminds me of McDonald's uh, chicken nuggets. It is tasty. I will say that. And for people who are vegan and don't eat meat or whatever. Veg vegetarian, not vegan. Because vegans, this is made in the same oil as the regular chicken. Oh, so you're getting a little bit of chicken for real. No. Probably you're right. I'm sure. But it is good. Mm -hmm. It is good. It is tasty. And, uh, you know, if you're, if you're, uh, you don't want to eat meat and you really miss, my wife, you know, she, she used to eat this stuff, eat chicken and all that, but and she was telling me how much she missed, you know, chicken, that this is a nice alternative for people who don't eat meat. And it is tasty, I gotta say that. Like, these are very tasty. Like, I, I, I could live with this. Like, if this saves a chicken's life, I'm good with it. Like, I could eat these and, and replace, you know, my chicken with this. I mean, you know, we'd be saving the planet, saving chickens, no more growing chickens by the by the friggin, you know, farm load or whatever. And it's tasty. It is good. I do like it. It's very tasty. And it's got the texture. It's all right. I think you could do just as well just buying one of those frozen bags of vegan chicken nuggets and frying it at home. Well, there's only certain brands that taste pretty good. Yeah. Like that one brand, I don't know the name of it, but... Oh, uh, that one brand tastes exactly like McDonald's chicken nuggets. Yeah. I mean, it's good. Do you remember the name? It's um, plant roots or rooted plants, something like that. It's rooted something. No, what we'll color bag it come in? You remember? It's like green. Yeah. Kind of remember that. A little that. bit of light blue. Yeah. We will get the name for you, and we'll try those next. But these are good. Like, this is worth the trip. You know, if you don't eat meat, even if you do eat meat. Like, I eat meat. But I can live with this. I can live with it. It's good. I like, I like that honey barbecue. The honey barbecue? Oh, uh, it's so good. It is good. I don't remember ever having this sauce before. So, that, my friends, is the review on... Kentucky Fried Chicken, Fried Chicken, Beyond Fried Chicken, plant-based, there you go.